but the reason why I'm in China is because um, of those two characters on Uzalu and I thank them you know even though they're not even actresses or actors in Uzalu I thank them because um, without them I wouldn't be here and um, I believe that God works in mysterious ways that you can never even understand because if if uh, if they didn't do what they did I wouldn't be here you know <music> yo what's up beautiful people and i'm back again with another video um uh the last time i was talking about myself uh i was talking about how i lost my channel and then i told you that on part two i'm gonna tell you why i deleted the channel because my channel was not terminated or anything i decided to delete the channel so i'm um, just wait a little bit and then you're gonna find out so um in 2017 that's when i arrived back to south africa um uh, from india to south africa 2017 and then uh, i knew about this um teaching english as a foreign language and then me and my roommate from india we went to uh this academy and then they told us that it's 15,000 rand and then i was like we were like hell no there's no way i had that in my position but i was like i'm not gonna pay that much what the fuck Fifteen thousand rands for just like a lousy certificate uh not knowing that this is like um it's, it's a very important um certificate because now i'm here because i have it i didn't know but then um we gave up and then um after that, I was continuing with my YouTube, trying to go to different campuses, university, uh, universities in South Africa, but then it did not work out. And then um, later on, let me just tell you, because um, I don't want to make this video that long. I was sleeping because I have been searching about um, teaching English in China, in South Korea, in Japan and all that. So this other day I was sleeping and then I woke up. And um, I can't really remember what video I was watching, but before that video played, um, there was this advert from South Africa that is talking about the the the, uh, the te teach English as a foreign language certificate. You know, it was talking about a TEFL, and um, they were saying that if you're doing it online, it's like 500 rands. I'm like, bitch, come on! I went to an academy. They told me that this is 15,005. Now I'm doing it for, for 500 rands, you know? And then quickly I applied. I started doing my, my, my course and then it was just like, you know, lesson plans and all that because I don't have a degree in education at all. So I was just like doing whatever I can. And um, well, I'm not gonna say luckily or fortunately or anything like that because I deserved it, I think. So um, I got it. Um, I graduated, I got my, my, my certificate and then um, I started applying um, for jobs in China and then I got this lady. This lady was from Beijing, she was Chinese, an agent, a recruiter and then she gave me a job that was offering me 10,000 RMBs which was 20,000 rand and then after a week, like only to find out that you can actually get more than that even if it's, uh, even as a, a beginner and then i was like ah, ha, ha, fuck you girl i'm gonna do my own shit right now and then i deserted that girl and then um <laughs> and then i got another job um maybe i conducted like um i don't know maybe like 20 interviews and out of 20 i only got like um maybe uh not 15 man i'm lying i only got seven I only got seven interviews right and then i had to choose and then i chose uh the one that was taking me to wushi the one that i was talking about on the first video and um yeah that was cool but then now the problem is here the documents um you need uh you need to 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 authenticate your degree your police clearance which uh some other people they call it non-criminal record and um um your TEFL certificates as well so um i was just like oh shit this is like um yeah this is gonna be a long process but then this is what happened i got a girl um 
I forgot your name girl if you're watching this video I'm so sorry but um the reason why I'm here it's because of you um this girl was like um I approached the girl on Facebook and then the girl was like you know what I can help you but you need to pay this much and then I paid like 750 and then you know what this is gonna blow your mind if you're from South Africa and you're in China I got my police clearance in two days within two days I had my police clearance on my possession and um, <clears throat> I did that uh, and then I had to send the documents back and then they were authenticated and all that and then I was like thank you so much oh, Lumka I think her name is Lumka ah oh, Lumka you know you're my angel you're my angel because uh, without you I wouldn't be here and then uh <clears throat> authenticated everything and then I got my documents and then in China I got my PU letter and everything and then um it was time to apply for for visa and everything and then uh yeah I got that but um talking about the YouTube channel uh for me it was just like um the end of the road I couldn't do any shit for me I was thinking like you know I've been doing this for years so in in order to be on TV but now um somebody or people decided to jeopardize my my career you know as um as whatever i wanted to be and um yeah <coughs> i'm so sorry about that and then um um yeah it was just like um i came here to china and then i was earning more than i was getting on youtube because on youtube minimum i would get like twenty five thousand rands which is a lot you know it's a lot at the same time you need to impress the people that knows you like from your area and all that because you are like you're basically you know you're technically on tv but you're not on tv but they see you online and shit like that and you get that pressure where you need to be like yo Pelamina, I can do this and that because I'm doing this online, you know. And um, so I came here to China. I was earning more than what I was getting on YouTube. And um, after that, man, after that, you know, um, after arriving here, I met a couple of uh, a couple of people, South Africans, and then we started drinking. We're doing this and that, and then it was just like happy times. And then on YouTube on my channel i mean on my page on facebook i'm getting like dms on my instagram when are you coming back to youtube and blah 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 and it was just like a lot you know i think i got over two or three hundred messages you know when are you coming back and blah 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 and then i decided to just uh to just delete my channel because um it was no longer working for me because when i came here i stopped watching muzalo i stopped watching skim sam i stopped watching uh the queen and Sibai. i just stopped so there was um I, I was like if i continue with this channel what am i gonna talk about because when i arrived i tried to continue to be like um a person who's gonna advise people like if you want to start a youtube channel this is what you must do this is like uh you know do's and don'ts and shit like that but yeah man it was not working out you know the life here is so much like it's it's totally different and um not that i was um i was sinking into alcohol or anything like that but then it was just like for me to to grow up at the same time and meet new people and do what i can do you know and then um i deleted the channel and um i told myself though that one day i'm gonna come back bigger and better and um that was it but the reason why i'm in china is because um, of those two characters on Uzalu, and i thank them you know even though they're not even actresses or actors in Uzalu, I thank them because um, without them, I wouldn't be here. And um, I believe that God works in mysterious ways that you can never even understand. Because if if uh, if they didn't do what they did, I wouldn't be here. You know, I'm so grateful for what they did, even if it was like sinister. But man, I'm thankful. And um, yeah, that's part two, man. But um, I'm loving it here in China. So now I think I can move on to episode six where we dive deeper. And um, if you're in China and you're watching my video and you know me, man, I'm not going to spill your beans. And I'm not going to do that. But um, I'm going to talk about shit on this channel. Trust me. Thank you so much for viewing this video. Man, I'm out. <laughs>